ua maokea o ka aina i ka pono. The life of the land is perpetuated in righteousness. This is an ancient Hawaiian saying that sustained Hawaiians for over a thousand years. The Ahupua'a system from Mauka Mountain to Makai Ocean uses the rain and land to grow fruits and vegetables and have rich, nutrient waters flow into fish ponds. This system sustained half a million Hawaiians for centuries. Our aquaponics program comes to us through a partnership we have created with the University of Hawaii. It's important that we are not simply doing one event once a year, a one-off. At Damien, we realize if we want to, as Pope Francis says, increase ecological justice and ecological education, we needed to create curriculum, programs, and specific courses that are semester long. Our aquaponics classes are taught, both in middle school and high school levels. It is project-based, hands-on learning, and this type of education will last a lifetime. Pope Francis's encyclical, Laudato Si, has called on the world to refocus and increase our care for our common home. Damien Memorial School has answered this call by engaging faculty and students in multiple programs, restoring ancient Hawaiian fish ponds to reclaim this priceless protein source, to continuing to develop our taro fields, and we are especially proud of our Damien's aquaponics program. Later this year, we are partnering with the Lion Arboretum, which works deep in Manoa Valley. Hawaii is home to 1,400 plant species, and 90% of them are found nowhere else in the world. Unfortunately, 200 species have gone extinct. Later this spring, Damien students will be working in Manoa Valley, eradicating invasive species and planting very rare and fragile Hawaiian flora. We will also be partnering with Malama Mauna Lua, an organization dedicated to preserving Hawaii's marine life and its fragile coral systems. Global warming has been taking a significant toll on our Pacific Ocean, and we are excited to have Damien students working on the reefs this spring to help eradicate an invasive species known as Gorilla Ogo. Without further ado, please enjoy our video about Damon's aquaponics program. C'è speranza. Tutti possiamo collaborare ognuno con la propria cultura ed esperienza, ciascuno con le proprie iniziative e capacità, perché la nostra madre terra ritorni alla sua originale bellezza e la creazione torni a risplendere secondo il progetto di Dio. Dio benedica ognuno di voi e benedica la nostra missione di ricostruire la nostra casa comune. Grazie. In response to Laudato Si, Damien Memorial has taken action by attending to the land we call home and by remembering to always give back to the Aina that has provided for us. A typical class, um, normally in the beginning of the semester, um, I have my students choose groups of between maybe five to seven students, uh, depending on the size of my class. And that's pretty much the um, groups that they'll be working with throughout the semester. And um, within those groups, they have a specific task for the day. So some of the tasks might include things like uh, feeding the fish, uh, measuring out the food, um, measuring the quality of the water for each of the fish tanks or the hydroponics table or aquaponics table, uh, watering the many plants that we have here around campus, um, including this lawn area, uh, plants in the Welcome Center, um, also others around campus using the water that we get from the fish tanks because it's uh, filled with lots of nutrients, or um, just maintaining and cleaning out the tanks and draining them. So those are um, some of the tasks that they complete for the day. The thing about aquaculture is there's a lot of benefits. First of all, it uses a lot less water than traditional farming. And we're talking about if you would have to grow crops in a field, you would use 90% more water for, the, for those crops than what you would use in a aquaponic system or a, even a hydroponic system. 
Uh, the second thing is it uses less area to grow crops. Uh, so if you have an acre of hydroponics or aquaponics being raised, it would take about three to maybe even 10 times the amount of area needed to grow the same amount of crops. Uh, the third uh, benefit to aquaponics is that most crops grow two times faster in this system. And the last one is in an aquaponic system, it would produce two items for you to, to sell, both the fishes that you're using in the water and the vegetables that you're growing. I had aquaponics for the last semester and I quite enjoyed it. I enjoyed the teacher and the class and how Mr. Murakami led the class and did all the lessons. I enjoyed just the different tasks that he had us do, such as like feeding the fish and watering the plants and helping the lettuce grow. I think it's important to teach young kids and, and growing adults that sustainability in the real world is good and that we should take care of our environment. It's especially good for Damien because it helps us learn to respect our community and our environment and teaches the young kids to grow up this way. Uh, my hope for the aquaponics program in the future is just to continue to teach my students the importance of sustainability, um, specifically through teaching them about the many benefits of hydroponics and aquaponics. And uh, eventually I would like to expand um, our aquaponics systems and our hydroponics systems so we can grow on a little bit of a larger scale. So maybe even one day, you know, provide some of our crops to the cafeteria or perhaps maybe even donate it, um, some of our surplus to the community. Yeah, what, one thing, uh, I think it's, it's good for the students to learn about these systems. And uh, they learn responsibility, they learn hands-on uh, in doing the lessons in growing these uh, items out here in the outdoor uh, science center.